Hello all, welcome. So today we will see deploying a Streamlit app integrated with Gemini Pro on Cloud Run. So let's see the overview. So in this lab, uh, we will understand how to integrate Vertex AI, Gemini API with applications and build and deploy the developed sample application on Google Cloud Run. So what is Gemini? So Gemini is the family of generative AI model developed by Google DeepMind that is designed for multimodal use cases. The Gemini API gives you access to the Gemini Pro Vision and Gemini Pro model. So uh, Vertex AI Gemini API. So the Vertex AI Gemini API provides a unified interface for interacting with Gemini models. And there are currently two models available in the Gemini API. So first one is Gemini Pro model uh, that is also called as Gemini um, Pro and Gemini Pro Vision model. It's also called as Gemini Pro Vision. And we can interact with Gemini API using the following method. So first method is uh, using the Vertex AI Studio. So it's used for quick testing and command generation. Then second using curl command and the third one use using the Vertex AI SDK. So in this lab we will focusing on the Vertex AI SDK for Python and we will call the Vertex AI Gemini API. Now the objectives. So in this lab, we will understand the integration of Vertex AI Gemini API into a sample application and subsequently build and deploy the application to Cloud Run. The sample application demonstrates a Cloud Run application that uses the Streamlit framework. So now we will set up the lab. So for this, we need to click on the start lab. It will take one or two minute to provision. Okay, now we will open the Google Cloud console. So username is automatically pop up. So let's click on next. Now we will enter the password. Click on I understand. We will agree the terms and condition. So this is the Google Cloud console. So first we need to activate the Google Cloud Shell. So this is the Cloud Shell. Uh, let me maximize it. First we will use this command. It will authorize the Google Cloud Shell. It will give us the active account information. Okay. Now we will use this command to list the project ID. So this is the project ID. Okay. So now the first task is we will run the application locally. So for this we will clone the repository. So this is the command for cloning git clone and the uh, URL of our uh, repository. Okay so cloning is done. 
now we will navigate to this uh, path so now we are in this directory so for running the streamlit application we need to perform the following step okay so now first we need to set up a virt python virtual environment and install the dependencies so this is the command for that Okay, it's uh, done. Now our application required two environment variable. First is GCP project. So this is the Google Cloud project ID, and the second one is GCP region. And so this is the region in which uh, we are deploying the Google Cloud uh, Google uh, Cloud Run app. Uh, so for example, the US Central one. This is the region. so and uh, this variable are needed since the vertex ai in initialization needs the google cloud project id and the region and the specified uh, code line from the app.py function is sh shown here so this is the line where uh, we have passing the project equal to project id and location equal to the location so we will execute this following command uh, so here we are passing uh, gcp project id and the region so uh, this is our id this is the same id and the region we are using is us central one now we will run the application locally for this we need to execute this command okay so here our application is available this is our application so it's the same we we have started the application so for stopping this application we need to enter control plus c in the cloud shell so let me do that now our application is stopped now second task is we will build and deploy the application to cloud run so for this we need to execute this command Okay. it's done now and we can see the status is success now the final step is to deploy the services in cloud run with the image that we had built and had pushed to the artifact registry in the previous step okay it's done now the service url is this let me open it okay 
so this is our application so let me check so it's completed congratulation so in this lab uh, we have learned uh, that uh, understanding of the integrated vertex AI Gemini API with applications and proficiency in building and deploying the de developed sample application on Google Cloud Run okay uh, so thank you for watching uh, if you like this video please uh, click on the like button and if you are new to the channel so please subscribe and if you have any suggestion or uh, clarification needed so please put your comment in the comment section yeah thank you